Hello everybody, it's Frank Order Gamer, and in this episode we're going to go to the nether. So, let me just get ready here. We still got to build another portal, but I have an area that we can kind of uh, set up the nether portal. But before we go, <gasps> look at all those diamonds. I went mining, I found maybe 20 diamonds, not all at once. And then with my fortune 3 pick, got 51 diamonds, and I made... The diamond pick, put 20 levels into it, efficiency 2, it's okay. But yeah, here we go, gonna head off to the nether, pretty much prepared. Uh, yeah, I think we're good. I think I'm gonna leave this diamond pick here. I think I'll just make a quick iron pick. Because we're, we're just gonna go look around a little bit. We're not gonna, you know, stay for a really long time. Bye, here we go. Oh, yeah, and I also enchanted a katana with 18 levels. Sharpness 2, fire aspect 2. That's really good. And then I got a fortune 1 on an iron pick. So that's also pretty good. Where am I going? I think it might be good to wear these. So, because they're fire protection. So, if I get lit on fire by gas. That will be helpful. Nope. Ah, come on. Okay, here we go. I think this looks pretty good over here. I also made that. That staircase. It's not really great looking. I mean, it kind of looks bad. So I think I'll fix that. Once we get back, I think that's what we'll do. Hopefully I do this correctly. Oh, God. Don't lag and make me do it wrong. Here we go. Ta da! Here we go. Let's see how it is. That sounded weird. Oops. I just wanted to make sure. Okay, normal. That's good. Okay, good. We didn't spawn underground. Just turn. Render distance down. I hate it when you spawn in those little pockets in the nether. Oh, good. This is good. We got glowstone right here. Grab some of this. I don't really want to use my fortune 3 on glowstone because it's not that important. Could have brought my fortune 1 iron pick. I think I'll do that next time. I'll use that for glowstone and coal. One stack almost. Still lagging. Okay, that should be good. Yeah, basically, I just wanted to take a look around. And I think this is the 13th episode of the series, so I think that's pretty fitting that we went to the nether. Okay. I'll just put down some torches so it's not pitch black and 61 that's pretty good let's go check it out down here nothing okay grab some nether rack I think I'll grab a half stack of this stuff because it just destroys your pickaxe I don't know what it is but I mean it just destroys your pickaxe thirty two okay thirty three that's fine okay let's dig out here oh no we got a terrible nether spawn no dang it no <laughs> Oh no, we can go up here. Whew, I was. Wait, no. Oh god, no. Don't be a bad nether spawn. Oh yeah, also, I found. I was in. I was mining around. Stumbled upon a cave system. And guess what I found? I came back later. Because I was mining and I ran into it again. And there is a slime. So, we got slime spawning chunk. 
We have one slime ball. Ugh, this spawn is terrible. There's nothing around. There's no way to get out. That bums me out. Wait. One final ch chance. There's a pillar up there. Is our last shot? Uh, no. Why do you do this to me, Minecraft? Yeah, this is not good. I have to make another nether portal to get out of here. Dang it. Well, I think off camera I'll dig around here, see if I can find a way out. Hopefully I will. Okay. We'll go back. That wasn't very exciting. And it is night time. The melon farm is working good, except are working well except I think um, a zombie or something ran in there and stepped on one of the crops there's their one slime ball we got another music disc so that's good I mean all you have to do to get music discs is just get a skeleton to kill a creeper so it's not not too difficult Let's see what was I gonna do I think we're gonna go sleep and we're gonna go fix that staircase I think I want to make a big storage room. I don't know why I went that way. Like just a big centralized storage room would be all labeled and stuff. I think we'll do that soon. I think I have a place where we can put it. Huh, usually it makes you take off your armor. What in the... How did you possibly get in here? God. And there's a pig in here. Wow. Oh yeah, I had beef back here. And there's a ninja just outside my house. Go take him out and a spider the other day it was in a minor league baseball game it was a single A it's a local single A team so you know it's just they're not great but anyways we were there and the home team that I guess was the you know the team from where around where I live? The player was batting, right? And he just lets go of the bat, and it goes flying over the dugout and into the stands. And I'm pretty sure it hit someone. It bounced on top of the dugout and then flew into the stands. And we were all just sitting there, like, did he re did he actually just do that? He just I don't even understand how he possibly could have messed up that bad. Like, he just let go of it. Didn't break. He just, it went flying. Okay, you'll make some sandwiches. And, okay. So, this doesn't really look that great. So, I think I'm going to take out all these fences. I think they're okay on this other side. Okay, they need to be lowered one. That's good. 
because I don't want to get creepered or anything like that. I think I'm going to change boots. Just randomly run back there. Boots away. Yeah, I got protection two and fire protection two. So I think I'm going to get, once I get that mob trap up and running, I'm going to just get like 50 levels and I'm going to enchant diamond armor. It's just going to be the most amazing diamond armor in history of Minecraft. It's going to all have 50 levels, 50 level enchants on it. So I think that's the plan. So let's see here. Let's take this out. Maybe I'll just lower that. Here, okay. Let me go grab some more bricks. That's not too bad. No, I don't want to replace those. Well, actually, I will. That looks pretty good. And then I just set this up so I didn't get creepered. Or, you know, they could just walk up and go in. So, yeah, this isn't too bad. I'm going to put some torches like that. And I think that's pretty good. 12 minutes already. When I make these episodes, time just flies. Pork chops. Make some pork chop sandwiches. Some pork sandwiches. Okay, I'm not going to turn that into glowstone yet. I think we're going to do something with, what do you call it, with uh, redstone lamps. I think that'd be pretty cool. I think I was going to do that in the mob trap so I can just turn it on and off. You know, I just have a lamp in each one of the pillars for spawning and then they'd, I'd hit a lever. They'd all turn on. They'd stop spawning. Just when I didn't want them to spawn so that it didn't lag really bad or anything like that. Okay, is there anything else I could do this episode? Not, not really. Let's go put away these shadukens. Dirt. Actually, wait, no. Oh yeah, and I have three ender pearls. So that's why I want to find blazes, because pretty soon... I might, like, eventually, not pretty soon, I have to get a bunch of arrows and stuff, but eventually, you know, gonna beat the Ender, dra ender Dragon. So, yeah. That would be pretty neat. It's pretty neat. And, yeah, I found some pretty huge cave systems with a lot of diamonds. I found some exposed diamonds uh, in quite a few places. That's where I found most of them. So that made me happy. But it's kind of weird how you can just see it down there. But um, I think we'll just harvest this wheat to end off the episode even though it's not all done growing. That's okay. Actually, let me go grab some bones. Just bone meal the last couple pieces. I think there's a mod that allows you to turn raw flesh into pork chops. I think I might install that. Actually, I don't need that nearly that many bones. And it's not a big mod at all. I mean, it just adds one item. So I think that would be the last one for this. <laughs> Let's play. So many mods installed. Okay. Slowly jump. Down. God. Okay, whatever. That's fine. 